Ayan, small businesses challenges are uh, are more likely to purchase new technologies no uh, usually due to outdated equipment and so uh, because of uh, outdated equipment or end of life events and enhanced security concerns also one of their challenges is budget constraints no so small business objectives is to attract new customers improve operational efficiencies and gain competitive advantage like having a digital payment options and so providing guest wi-fi access and more so example verticals you know, businesses are like are uh, cafes restaurants independent hotels and more no so with this in mind smb customers need an enterprise grade hardware or a functional uh, functionality of that no? at a fraction of its cost no. so aruba instant on solution got you on this why Aruba Instant On? No. So why Aruba Instant On? Because it's simple, hassle-free to set up, unified management for wired and wireless Aruba Instant On devices through a mobile app or cloud-based web portal. So and, uh, uh, simplicity at its best. Best in class security in terms of secure guest and uh, employee access. So there's a uh, uh, later on, we can, we will discuss that uh, uh, Aruba Instant On is capable of having a uh, SSID on for employees or and for guests. Yeah, no? Integrated WPA or WPA3 and opportunistic wireless encryption, uh, an enterprise uh, Wi-Fi security standard for secure open networks. You know? So when we say OWE, you know, so what it does is uh, all wireless traffic goes encrypted in uh, instead of in clear text. So always on network. Yeah, so superior software hardware quality from a trusted vendor, HP. Yeah, we all know that. A high performance Wi-Fi network and unmatched user experience and, and support. Mm -hmm. So unveiling the new Instant On 1930s switch series. So on Aruba, on Aruba Instant On portfolio switch series. For now, you know, guys, we only have 1930 switch series. But it has seven SKUs, no? so mix and match of uh, eight ports, 24 port, 48 port gigabit ports, and uh, class four PoE or non PoE switches, and it has also a uh, uh, SFP or SFP plus ports uh, on 24 and 48 ports model for fiber connectivity or uplink natin, no? so it, it is a L2 smart managed switch, switch, and uh, on the management modes. So, uh, we have two modes, which is cloud manage. Uh, particularly, it's a uh, mob through mobile app. So, download lang natin yung mobile app, and yan i ano natin I incorporate natin yung switch natin to the mobile app and web based port uh, cloud based web based portal. So, another one is through local management web UI. So new security software uh, enhancement, ARP, ARP attack, and DHCP snooping, snooping, and new aesthetic design to complement wireless access points. So formerly, uh, binabandel namin to or uh, ilano namin to with the Office Connect switches of uh, HP, you know, same yung mga Aruba instant on access points natin. So lately, uh, I mean later, papaita natin yun. So yung uh, Office Connect switches kasi natin as a gray uh, casing. So this. So now we have the 1930 switch line, you no, know, which has a white uh, white casing that complements with the Aruba uh, Aruba Instant On wireless access points. So, uh, yun, moving on about the warranty. So, yun, as always, Aruba devices have a limited lifetime warranty. Yeah, so mga switches, yeah, with next business day advanced hardware replacement shipment. With the purpose-built wired solution, you no, know, moving on tayo. Uh, with the 1930 switch series, you know, simplicity. So as mentioned earlier, we have the app-based management. You know, for uh, we can uh, manage the switches, the devices through mobile app or cloud-based access. You no, know, without uh, further, uh, without uh, license or additional license or subscription fees. You no, know. so because we can uh, manage it through mobile app or cloud-based uh, portal. We can remotely manage multiple sites from anywhere and anytime. So reliability, uh, because of uh, rel its reliability, we have stronger connectivity. Uh, ayun nga, no? as mentioned earlier, we have the uplink ports, which is uh, the SAP or SAP plus ports for uh, fiber connectivity. 
And ayun, no, flexibility to choose from 824-48 port switch, non-POE and POE models. So POE, and uh, we all know that that uh, it en enables powering of devices like IP phones, cameras, wireless APs, uh, uh, yeah, without uh, additional cost. Uh, Security-wise, we have ACLs. No? So built-in yung mga ACLs natin dito. So uh, as of now, oh, the ACLs are only available on the local web GUI, but in the future, in the future release, it will also be supported on the cloud or in the mobile app or in the cloud-based uh, portal na uh, management niya. Yeah. So it supports also the 802.1x. So ayun, as mentioned kanina dun sa ClearPass, uh, yun yun, yun, yun yung uh, radio server ni, ano namin, ni, ni Aruba, which is on the enterprise side. No? And ACL rules to ward off uh, external security threats and malware. Peace of mind. Ayan, uh, as mentioned, uh, limited lifetime warranty ang mga switches lagi ni uh, Aruba. Mm -hmm. Ayan. So in terms of Aruba Instant On Wireless Portfolio, we have the indoor APs, Ayan. the hospitality APs, and the outdoor. Uh, so actually, this is not just built for small businesses, no? So, but also for small office or home office setup. So in the indoor uh, access point, we have the entry level uh, instant on AP11, which has the which has a two by two uh, MIMO antenna, but uh, Wi-Fi five wave two. Mm. Next one is the AP12, and the high end one is the AP15, which has the four by four four by four uh, new MIMO antenna. So in the hospitality access point, we have only one. Uh, Access, po access point, which uh, which is uh, instant on AP 11D, which is uh, can be desk or wall mounted. No, and the the outdoor we only we also have uh, outdoor access points, which is AP 17. Yeah, no. So later on, no, I have a dedicated slide for ideal deployment of these uh, access points. Yeah, moving on. Mm -hmm. Ayan. Uh, loud and clear naman, guys, no? I mm -hmm. uh, just want to present, uh, to share one video on how to, uh, on the unboxing of this uh, Aruba Instant on Access Points and uh, how to set, set it up. Hi, I'm Greg from Aruba, and I'm here to show you just how fast and easy it is to get your Wi-Fi network up and running with Aruba Instant on. These access points, or APs, were designed with a small business user in mind. First, we're going to unbox it, and second, we're going to walk you through and show you just how easy and just how fast it can be. This is an unboxing video, so let's talk about that box, both outside and in. On the outside, you will see arubainstanton.com. Feel free to go there for information. On the inside, however, when you open this box, you are greeted by the quick start. That will get you up and running in no time. Also, hardware installation guide, and some compliance information. Without further ado, however, I give you the Aruba Instant On 11D. Now, it also comes with a desktop mount right out of the box. So you can get set up, pop it on your desktop and go. But also, if you don't want it on your desktop, you have a wall mount kit, which is right here. This has screws included and also a six foot ethernet cable. So that was the contents of the box. Now let's plug it in and really have some fun. When you start, go to the quick guard first. Number one says plug in, so we'll do just that. Using the ethernet cable that was included in the kit, we will plug in first to the device. Now when you're plugging this in, make sure you look for the EOPT port, like so. Then we'll be plugging into the switch. In this case, it's a POA switch that will give power to the device. Number two, it says stand by. So I will wait here until the light goes green and amber. Now while you're waiting for number two to finish, you can do number three, which is download the app. In this case, I'm going to the app store. I'm going to find Aruba Instant On. And there it is, ready for me to download. So you've downloaded the app and now you're really ready to set this thing up. You open the app and enter your credentials, which is your email and password that you've created. Once I'm there, I'm ready to log in. So entering that information, I'm then prompted to set up a new site. 
I can set up my network by pressing continue at the lower right hand corner. This takes me to the next set up your network screen, which you enter your network name and network password that you determine. After you set this up, you're then prompted to add new devices. In this case, we'll be adding this device. Using Bluetooth, it will detect a device nearby. When you select that device, you will then be prompted to add the country. Enter that information and you're ready to go. Okay, that was fast, that was easy. What if you need to extend your network? What if you need one more AP? Well, it's pretty easy with one touch mess setup. This will be activated in no time. So let's add a new device. Select the bottom right hand corner. Then you'll be prompted to add a new device on the screen where it says, extend my network. Now you select extend network over the air. This will bring you to the screen where your device is searching for another device. When the device is found, you will then be able to add it. Make sure you accept then you are given the option to name the device or move forward. Once you've done that step, boom, you now have two or more devices on your network. And no wires connected. Aruba Instant On, simple, secure, high performance access points for all of your needs. Indoors, outdoors, we have a solution for you. This is simplicity at its best. Yeah, purpose-built wireless uh, solution. So, ayun, uh, as on per the video uh, a while ago, so simplicity, no? so we saw that uh, it has a, the, the management is only on the mobile app or in the cloud-based access ayun, with no additional license and subscription fees. So, same with the wired ones. No? So, now we're in the wireless one. Mm -hmm. So, remote uh, remotely manage multiple sites from anywhere, anytime. Business growth. So, uh, Aruba Instant On access points as a scalability. You know, of, uh, it manages 25 APs in a network, uh, mix and match of different Instant On models, and it supports up to eight SSIDs. Uh, yun. Next one is a uh, secure Wi-Fi wi in every corner of your space. So coverage, you know. So with, uh, if we need coverage, we have this feature called Smart Mesh. So it easily expands network to hard wire areas. So you know, uh, get re reliable signal in every corner of your business. Integrated WPA2 or WPA3, so uh, enterprise security standard. Peace of mind, we have the uh, good, uh, good, uh, good, great uh, post sale support, which has a uh, phone and chat support, one year warranty, and instant on community. So, instant on community is a forum for the Aruba instant on devices. So, check that uh, site, guys. Uh, Google lang natin, and ayun. So, uh, and daming mga uh, tutorials uh, doon sa instant on community na yun, and other stuff na matututunan natin, like general knowledge about uh, wireless and wire. Uh, uh, networks. Yeah. So now, Aruba Instant On has an end-to-end -end small business solution. So from a uh, switch, a 1930 switch series, access points, and simple management of its devices. So, and guys, no, for those who will ask if Aruba Instant On access points and switches can be managed on Aruba Central, uh, ayun, the answer is no. No, this this is very different from Aruba Enterprise Enterprise offerings, uh, just like what uh, Sir Red uh, discussed a while ago. And this portfolio portfolio targets SMB businesses. So, uh, ayun, for, for us to be competitive on the pricing uh, on the SMB business side. So, uh, later uh, I have a slide for that uh, of why we have the Aruba Instant Order. Key values no? with Aruba Instant On portfolio in mind, it can help for your business growth, in, uh, increase revenue, and of course build stronger relationship. So, in terms of uh, target market clients of this portfolio, so businesses with less than 100 users, and also the the do it for me or do it yourself customers service by Aruba Business or proximity partners. 
So, ayan, yung mga use cases natin, typical verticals, ayan, uh, mga small businesses, existing customers natin that uh, usually yung mga uh, want to upgrade to Wi-Fi 5 Wave 2 uh, access points, ayan, no, mga devices uh, that are catching up with the technology nga, ayan, and competitive take-up. So, ayan guys, no, so this is... Um, Aruba Instant On versus Aruba Instant AP. So, don't be confused with this, guys. No? So, Aruba Instant On, as uh, said a while ago, this is for the small businesses. So, Hiwalay siya. This is totally different from Aruba Instant AP that we have, which is the IAP. We call it uh, IAP. Na, um, for uh, enterprise uh, offerings. No? So, ayan, no? ito yun. No? I, I just highlighted the important ones. No? On the ion side or on the positioning, so ayun, less than 100 users for small businesses nga. And uh, for the IAP side, it's for the more than 100 users. No? So, pinoposition namin siya as ganun. Uh, management modes. So, ion as a mobile app and cloud-based portal, different from central to. Uh, so, for the IAP, we have the, for the cloud-based uh, management, we have the Aruba Central. Yeah. So, and for it's, it is an enterprise offering then from uh, Aruba and uh, multi-vendor air, airway web-based web GUI. So, IT support naman, little or no IT stuff needed for the ION. And ayun lang sa IAP, syempre, uh, this is an enterprise offering. So, we need an IT generalist or specialist. So, mas uh, granulated yung mga features nito and uh, mga fa and function. Eh. That's why. Upgradeability option and use cases. So, ayan, as mentioned then earlier, 25 APs per network and it supports up to 8 SSIDs per radio. So, I uh, both radio. Uh, and I think that's enough naman for the small businesses naman. So, usually, uh, on the SSID side, we have only the employee SSID and the guest uh, SSID. Yeah. So, in the IT, uh, in the IAP side, we have, uh, it is a scalable, customizable, and upgradable. No? So, from, uh, it can be a campus access point. Uh, it can be a uh, Upgraded to uh, they call this remote controlled access points if it's on the large enterprise uh, deployment and yun, it's cloud by the uh, through uh, Aruba Central and use cases yeah mid large networks it supports up to 108 128 APs per network so this is for the IAP side the uh, remote yung virtual uh, controller lang siya and it supports up to 16 SSIDs per radio. Wi-Fi standards. No? So on the ION side, we only have Wi-Fi 5 Wave 2. And for the IAP side, we have the we have options for the Wi-Fi 5 and Wi-Fi 6. So ayun, oh, in the Wi-Fi 5 Wi-Fi 5 Wave 2 is somehow sweet spot on today's or for now's for now's uh, uh, bandwidth demand in small businesses. So, uh, but on an enterprise deployment, we, we highly recommend of having a uh, Wi-Fi 6 capable APs. So, one of the reasons is for future proofing uh, because nowadays Wi-Fi 6 capable devices are going out on the market. So, in lang. Uh, brand of portfolio, support, warranty, we all know that discussed earlier. It was discussed earlier. Mm -hmm. Some built-in features and in capabilities. Ito, uh, as fast as possible na lang kasi parang um, hawala na ako ng oras. Oh, so, i-run through na lang natin ito. No? So, ayan, the, uh, uh, how it works, uh, built-in DHCP not support. So, and DHCP to give uh, 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 to lease uh, IP addresses on the clients, not uh, to translate public IP address or to uh, private IP address, vice versa. And so integrated router and firewall, uh, the integrated router and firewall. No? The AP can assign DHCP addresses, yeah, and as mentioned earlier, and uh, and performs performs NAT for clients and other wired mesh APs. No? It also uses non-configurable access list or pre-built rules for security. Yan. So, on the per, S, uh, per SSID, per user rate limiting, so QoS, no? on the mobile app or web, or web, you can easily set up different QoS rate, like controlled bandwidth usage per SSID or per user. Client or device blocking. No? So, using MAC address for fast and easy security fix. 
via app or web uh, cloud web portal. Mm -hmm. Usually for the users na, or devices that is over consuming bandwidth. Yeah. This is the easy fix for that. But uh, it's not recommended because uh, MAC address can be uh, slow uh, easily, uh, spook easily. And so traffic visibility and blocking. Mm -hmm. Visibility into app and web traffic using integrated de uh, deep packet inspection engine. Mm -hmm. Easily block up to 19 categories of content like sports, adult entertainment, social network, uh, gaming, and so on. All without an external firewall, enabling simplicity and cost savings. But, syempre, iba pa rin yung may dedicated firewall tayo if we are on the enterprise or side. Or, yun, mas marami kasi siyang uh, capabilities, mas marami siyang uh, minagagawa features, and uh, so on. Yeah. Yeah, so Aruba Instant also has an internal captive port, uh, portal feature, but it also supports guest portal integra integrations, no? such as uh, Facebook Wi-Fi, SkyPy, uh, WaveSpot, Isel Labs. Yeah. So we can uh, uh, look on the community, neto, uh, I mean the Instant On community, of how to do this. Ano? Yeah. Uh, enhanced troubleshooting using Bluetooth, no cabling required. So, ayan, no? Uh, kanina, nung no, up natin yung uh, Aruba Instant On, ayta natin that it all, all, only uses Bluetooth, no? AP tells you when there's a problem during initial setup pa lang. So, AP wire port visibility. So, real-time status on how your ports are working. So, ayan, no? May, uh, every blink of the, uh, no, uh, the, the, the LEDs that we have is uh, there's a and uh, there's, a, there's a meaning of it, like port status is down, port speed negotiation, download and upload speed, so and. See, to configure AP host names, no? so you can configure host names for your APs for the purpose of and, troubleshooting, uh, deployments, and makes reports easy to read. And lead quiet mode, no? so ito, medyo naging, na, nahiwagaan din ako, but ayun, uh, Mm, some kasi, uh, some customers doesn't want to see LED lights flashing no so example of uh, businesses uh, na, na experience natin ito is from the uh, hotel, hotels no uh, particularly on their hotel hallways so, uh, then ayun. and to maintain the new ambient lighting and that cause light pollution uh, yun. So, and it's only controlled through the mobile app, not on the hardware itself, no? on the mobile app only. And lastly, we have the Aruba Instant on Smart Mesh use cases. No? So Smart Mesh is a feature nga to, as mentioned earlier to uh, cover the hardware areas or places. So ito yung isang example on how to deploy it. Yeah. I mean the one example of use cases of it. And from the second floor, uh, meron tayong uh, nag-mesh tayo through uh, going to the first floor and, and so. RF enhancements and controls. So, and control of network bandwidth and channel width. And also, ability to control network band. These configs are under the advanced tab to keep the overall config simple. No, you can choose the network band of operation of the APs, whether it is uh, 2.4 and 5 gigahertz uh, or 2.4 gigahertz only, yung, yung, niya, yung, yung network band niya, uh, na binabato, or 5 gigahertz only. So, ayun, pag 2.4 gigahertz, mas malayo yung range. Uh, pag 5 gigahertz naman, uh, mas konti yung range niya, pero mas mabilis. Ayan. Uh, hindi congested yung network niya, network band. On the uh, ability to control channel width, uh, so ayun, be advised that the performance trade of, of using wide channel width is having an interference on overlapping channels. Ano? So this in turn will likely outweigh the output, uh, I mean the throughput benefits. So ayun, medyo uh, ingat lang tayo dito, so medyo advanced na to, pero ayun, depende sa IT. Ano? Mm -hmm. So I'm going configure, I mean. So ideal deployments. Yeah, ito, as promised uh, earlier. So, yeah, we got you covered. No? For the AP11, uh, usually sa mga Soho, uh, sa office, uh, sa small office, home office, for one to five users. And so it depends on the uh, what they are doing. No? So, 
uh, or in the their bandwidth uh, needs. Mm -hmm. Boutiques, retail shops, ayan. For the AP11D, ayan, sa so home, pwede nga natin siya i-desmount. Medical offices, sa reception, sa hotel, ayan, sa table. Mm -hmm. For the AP12, ideal deployments then is for uh, doctor offices, uh, cafes, boutique hotels, restaurants. For the AP15, ayan, yung medyo high-end na indoor AP natin, is for the tech startups, design firms, professional offices. And for the outdoor, AP, we have the AP17. No? So, pwede yan sa uh, outdoor na cafes and open restaurants. So, ayan, uh, example ng hospitality deployment. Yeah, no. From uh, SP, we have the ISP, the modem that given by the ISP. No, uh, pagkai mga uh, mga pangbahay ng mga router. Yeah, then we will connect the 1930 switch that we have. And ayon, uh, let's say PO yung 1930 switch that uh, we have. Yeah, pwede natin siya connect dito sa mga access uh, access points. Like in dito sa reception, we have the AP11D uh, desk mount. No? Uh, for the rooms 1 to 10, mm -hmm. use the AP12 here. And uh, for the pool side, we have the AP17 for the outdoor. So, you know, as we can see, there are three SSIDs for uh, employees SID number one, employee SSID two, and for the guest SSID. So, ayun, pwedeng naka-open yung, usually some hotels have uh, open uh, SSID, I uh, guess, Wi-Fi, like, you don't need to go to a captive portal or uh, uh, some some site to uh, fill up some forms. And so the next one is uh, the retailer cafe deployment. And it's easy as that, no? For the cafes, yeah, we have the uh, AP11 for the reception, and for the patio, we have the AP17, which is uh, major outdoor outdoor dinion. So we uh, we have the AP17. Yeah. Competitive. So, ayan, alam na natin, medyo may, in our mind, we have this uh, competitor, no, na talagang uh, nagkikipag-compete si Aruba Instant on. So, without further introduction, it's uh, uh, Ubiquiti. So, our director, competitor on this segment, ayan, si Ubiquiti, Merakigo. Actually, si Merakigo, if not, I'm not mistaken, it's not, uh, it's not currently available in the Philippines, eh. Yeah. And other SMB APs brands such as uh, ayun, uh, Ingenious, Linksys, Tipling, Dealing, yeah. para makasabay tayo sa kanila on this segment. Mm -hmm. So our value add over Merakigo. So ayun, no, I highlighted again the important ones. No? So in the instant on side on the AP platforms, we have the... Yeah, no, if to lahat ng ano natin ng access points on the ubiquity side they have the wave one no? wi-fi wi-fi 5 wave one palang iba and the support yeah mas uh, ano tayo mas solid tayo sa support when it comes to support uh, enterprise quality aruba instant brand uh enterprise grade reliability and uh in terms of uh ubiquity as far as i noted uh, uh, Okay, uh, gateway needs to be provisioned from scratch upon power failure. So, ayun, as far as I know, totoo to, eh. mm. based on experience. No? So, ease of use, simple to deploy, no cloud key or gateway needed. Uh, as far as I know, with the ubiquity, kailangan mo ng cloud key. Eh. It's a uh, hardware na sinasaksak lang support. Parang uh, network adapter lang siya na USB port. Uh, I mean, uh, RJ45 na may network adapter din yun. Parang uh, rectangle shape, something lang siya. Ayan. So you need that. Unlike sa Aruba Instant On, we only need the mobile device, the application, or the account on the cloud base on uh, Aruba Instant On website. So gateway features, ayan. Built-in advanced features including guest access, and DHCP, NAT, QoS. So ayan, no? so UBKT requires an external gateway. And remote management, yes. And the ARM, uh, this is the adaptive remote uh, management of uh, radio management of uh, Aruba access points, enterprise Aruba access points that is incorporated in Aruba instant on uh, uh, APs. So imagine how gaano kasulit si, ano, si Aruba instant on in terms of, uh, you know, uh, 
uh, because it has a functionality of an enterprise grade access point. And so in the BGT side, it requires manual config of each AP, no, 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 no radios. Niya. Mm -hmm. So value add over Meraigo naman tayo. So yun niya, hindi pa nga lang to available si Meraigo sa Philippines. But uh, yun, instant on mode, uh, instant on has uh, advantage on the AP models because, because it has uh, five models. No? On indoor, three on indoor, one on outdoor, and another one for the uh, hospitality. So Meraigo was only two uh, indoor or uh, two models on the indoor or outdoor. So support-wise, and mas solid pa rin tayo sa support. Multi-site management, yes, because of the app, uh, mobile app that we have. Yeah, and cloud portal. And, ayun. And, lastly, why we win? Ayan, because uh, we have extraordinary support experience. Yeah, no, 90 day phone and chat for one year. No, na, uh, complementary yung 90 days na yun. And one year warranty for the uh, instant on uh, instant on APs and limited life, lifetime warranty for the Aruba switches. Uh, Aruba instant on switches. Yeah, no. And the uh, instant on community, you know, yung forum ni Aruba instant on. Trusted vendor, we know that Aruba is uh, one of a uh, trust, uh, trusted brand that we know. Mm -hmm. Recognized as a leader in wireless LAN and wired space, superior hardware or software quality, simplicity. Yeah, ito yung lagi nating uh, ina, uh, sinasabi sa mga clients, which is uh, through mobile app nga lang and cloud-based portal. And ayan, one of the ben uh, benefit uh, of having an Aruba access point or APs or switches is no subscription subscription fees, no licenses fees and lower TCO. Yeah, so inbuilt advanced feature set, no external security appliance required. So again, for the small businesses, but of course in uh, for the enterprise side, we need a uh, gateway appliance now for that. Uh, dedicated gateway appliance. So I think that's it, no? Uh, that's the end of my presentation.